It's uh, intended to allow someone who's in a wheelchair to help sweep the floor of the home they live in. Uh, it basically attaches on the back and it uses a rotating duster uh, pads, I guess. So. Yeah. yeah. It's kind of just clean up the floor, pick up dirt, debris, and dust off the floors. So. Yeah. It, it gives them a the user, I guess, a new found feeling of like independence. Yeah. A lot of pressure on it. Oh no! There we go. There we go. Yeah. Remove it out. Which ones do these? Does it matter which ones we solder into here? Well, aren't they connected to the pins? So our project is basically a universal remote that we've made it more simple. These three jacks right here will have buttons plugged into them, so they'll be able to hit buttons and um, run it through a program. In this is our microchip. It has a microcontroller that has uh, sends out macro signals when you hit a button. So it sends out what you, what we want the remote in here to do. So the remote will send, uh, I mean it's uh, coded to the TV, so when we hit a button, it'll go through the microcontroller, tell the TV to turn on, turn off, uh, the VCR to pause and play, and, um, and then turn a stereo on and off. I might start with pause, but then you just hit it again. You hit it again, yeah, you just gotta get in the reverse cycle. Yeah. Oh, come on. Um, so our client that we built this for, she lives in the 19th Street homes. Yeah. Yeah. Um, She's in a wheelchair now, so she has basic basic motor skills, so she wouldn't be able to press little buttons on a remote. So we made these, we have big, like, three-inch buttons, and they're color-coded. So she'll be able to slap the button to do, like, turn on the functions and make it work for her, so it's pretty easy.